Oh, that was cool. Hopefully none. Care to explain how Halbeck lost its missiles? Old news. An accounting error. The missiles. You didn't lose them, did you? Thanks, Paul. Angry, Mr. Thornton? Because of what happened in Saudi Arabia. Diddle-loo, 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 diddle-loo. <laughs> Mike, can you read me? I'm getting lots of interference. I made it to Saudi Arabia, sir. I'm at the safe house. I guess that much. See any shadowy agents Ooh. in trench coats at the airport? No, sir. I don't think so. That was a joke, Mike. But stay on your toes anyway. Finding Shahid is your primary objective. Trouble is, we don't know his location. But we have three leads. An arms dealer, Nasri, is believed to have sold the missiles to Shahid, and he's currently operating in Saudi Arabia. If you can intercept him, maybe he can tell you where Shahid is, or guide you to the missiles. Sounds simple enough. Depending on the firepower he's brought to sell, I doubt it. Don't get careless. We also tracked down the location of an airfield Shahid used in the past. If you can sneak in and plant a listening device, we may be able to track flight Shahid is using to move through Saudi Arabia. And the third lead? We've got the coordinates of an al Samad detention camp, also used as a stockpile for weapons. We suspect the missiles may mm. be stored there. Intel. Is there any way to be sure the missiles are there? Not at this time. The area is dug into the side of a canyon, and getting reliable satellite imagery when sandstorms aren't blowing has been almost impossible. We'll want you to go in alone. Sandstorms, hey? Area and shut down their radar and communications. Cover? Once that's down, we can call in air support and hit the camp hard. No pressure. And no backup. Get used to it. It's the job. You check out your new home yet? It's got some perks you might be weapons? interested in. Weapons? I don't know. Anything beyond the weapons? See something over there. That might hold your attention. It oh, we'd actually like that. Anything okay. Else? A computer with a hub connection so fast you'll feel like you're going back in time. <laughs> What, to the Stone Age? Please. You can do dossier. <laughs> the video streaming was amazing back then. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Access some of the weapons dealers in the area. That'll be done on your own dime, however, using whatever funds you can find in Saudi Arabia. I understand, sir. We wouldn't want Alpha Protocol tied to any weapons trafficking in the Middle East. Exactly. The weapons locker okay. you already found. Help yourself to what's inside. Just be sure to choose the ammo and armor you think suits the mission. When you're ready to you're head out, monkey. just use the front door or access Say his the name from the main appears. terminal. I'll have already uploaded all the mission specs to your <laughs> Thank you, Heavy, for the $20 and donation. Them at any time. Hey, man. All right, so is that it? Westridge. Great. Home sweet home. All right, here we go. Heavy, thank you very much for your $20 donation. That's really kind, man. Thank you so much. Hope you're doing well. Oh, man. So we have a little uh, hub area now. And, um, yes, live streaming back in 2010 was incredible, as you can see, through encrypted networks. Man. Man. You're working a lot? Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. Ah, oh, I miss you, buddy. Um, how, how can you spend your AP? Oh, how can... How, wait, why, why am I reading that right? Reading that wrong. Uh, you can spend your AP to acquire new skills. Okay, so we've got 17. Uh, we probably should put them more into... I feel like stealth is still... Alright, here's my thought process. I I'm thinking every time we level, we put something into stealth. I think that's a requirement. Uh, so people can't really suspect us, you know, I suppose, m more than they do. Pistols I'm going to try and put into as well. Uh, I think I might do two on this one. And then I think we go for sabotage or one of those in between. I'm not particularly interested in rifles or anything. Maybe the assault rifle. Um, um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know about the more lethal stuff. Man, you just want to show some love? Thank you, man. That's really kind. Thank you for the funny monkeys. I appreciate it. Uh, okay, so let's put it into this because awareness improves Mike's ability to sense enemy placement and positions. At the master level, Mike no longer uh, needs, to, needs to activate his ability or this ability. Okay. Uh, his senses are always in a full state of alertness. God, imagine. But what is the next one? Shadow Operative. Allows nature to move unseen through... Okay, maybe two might be good for this one. 
Uh, can only can only be triggered if no alert enemy can see you. Okay. When activated, you are invisible for the duration of the ability, or until you run fire weapon. Okay, I, I think that's a good idea. <laughs> God Squad, you got a very big focus on the orphan number, <laughs> assault rifles. Uh, yeah, for making an orphan number increase. Exactly, exactly. Uh, but I don't really want to do that. Uh, so. Let's do that one. Uh, okay, we've got no points left. I think that I want to see the chain shot, though. I want to see what that's like. Uh, interference, fine. Health would be nice. Um, martial arts, I don't know. I, maybe we'll put a few points into it later, but... It seemed like my fisticuffs were kind of doing okay. Internet is bad here, but anyways, I hope you're doing well. Yeah, yeah, we're doing okay. I'm, I'm a little bit unwell today. Just a bit of a bit of a stomach ache, but... Um, but having fun with Alpha Protocol. Haven't played this in 14 years. And uh, we re released on GOG recently, for those of you interested. Okay, I, I think this is a good idea. Uh, silent running, though. Advanced. Ah, we'll worry about that next time. Testing the waters. So we did get a couple things there. That's cool. 5% discount from Saudi vendors. I were a betting man. Okay, so I guess we check check the hub now. Pretty cool, right? Get a little hub area. For some reason I'm reminded of Call of Duty 4, Modern Warfare. <laughs> uh, open weapon locker. Thank God no one checks this cupboard. Armor mods, two weapons. Okay. Maybe we go armor first. Let's see. Sound dampening, casual attire. Right, I think the one thing I used to overlook um, when I originally played this from, from my memory, um, and I think I, maybe I saw a playthrough years ago. I think someone mentioned something like sound dampening is like one of the main things if uh, you're going for a kind of more of a stealth approach, which we are. Um, so yeah, I think we're going to focus definitely on the sound dampening type. Damage reduction, we'll try and get something good, but... Uh, night operations, yeah. What does casual tire look like? I do kind of like the casual tire. <laughs> I think I'll stick with this one, though. Uh, oops, nope, didn't mean to exit out of that. Open back up, please. Especially how close the assault rifle stats are to uh, the orphan stats. All right, so pistol, what else we got here? Okay. Cool. Right, so that's equipped. Uh, barrels, so answer. No sights, magazine, nothing, nothing, okay. But we might have to take this with us, potentially. Or can I not? Unequip? No, you have to take something with you. Okay. Yeah, well, we don't have anything for that. Uh, gadgets. We can go on gadget three. Nothing. Go, go, gadget. First aid kit. Okay. Cool. Alright, we got that set. A uh, computer room that's very, uh, very hidden. What else we got? Just a bedroom. Now oh, it's tea time. And, uh, alright, I'll check that out in a sec. I'll have a look everywhere. Customized Thornton? Ah, okay. All right, so if I want to change anything here, got it. Most obvious secret agent, yep. I think it's pretty obvious he's secret. Definitely. Emails. Okay. Uh, I'm guessing Westridge already gave you the lecture about not using agency funds on high-profile assassination missions. Yes, it was, uh, it was advised not to, but we might. 
Aside from what's in your safe house, you'll have to make use of whatever you can borrow, swipe or steal. If you need supplies, try the clearinghouse. It's a black market internet exchange. Um, there's a seller there named Mongoose, who should be able to provide you with the basics while you're in Saudi Arabia. And speaking of stealing, a contract of mine in the US government just dug up an AI Samad slush fund. Well, I was going to read that as slushies. Uh, buried in a uh, jo Jordanian bank account? Okay. I've enclosed the... Where's the data self-extract executable? And do it soon. I, there is a lot of readings. I will do my best with this. But uh, we all know reading's not my strong suit on a stream. Uh, outside of chat. <laughs> <laughs> uh, keep an eye out uh, for any other funds you can abscond during your mission. We're not worried about journalists investigating. Okay. Download. I have money. Okay. My cover email. Hello, Mike. Welcome aboard. I have already set you up with an email address. Uh, yep, I, I realize that. <laughs> mthornet at halbeck.com. Nice. <laughs> You going into lurk mode? Have a good day, Stormy and crew. No worries. No worries, Lauren. Thank you very much for your 1k bits. I really appreciate that. You have a good rest after a night out. Hope it was fun. Mm -hmm. Just finishing off my coffee. Um, okay. So, don't worry. This email won't uh, sit on some corporate server. I've made all mail and oh, it gets redirected. Okay. Your login password is, uh, yes, that is a password. Minus the quotes. Of course, change it uh, when you first log in. Let me know if you have any questions. All right, so we can reply to this. We can pick a professional reply. We can pick a suave reply. The so, professionals, thanks for the warm welcome. Glad to be part of the team. Suave, great. Now I can pretend I'm a salary man at a multinational corporation. I don't have any kids, so maybe f I'll photograph my guns and put little frame pictures on my firearms on my desk. Uh, at the at the company party, okay. Uh, at the company party, we could totally get drunk. <laughs> okay, all right, I'm not reading that. Uh, then, <laughs> then spend the next month acting all awkward when we meet up in the hallway. Just kidding, the getting drunk part is optional. <laughs> Suddenly I feel like I'm reading, like, my, my moderator channels. <laughs> That's pretty good. Aggressive. Thanks, but if I want to stay in touch with someone, uh, I'll meet with them in, in person. I was gonna say prison. In person, uh, I don't get- I, I don't need matters of national security bouncing around civ uh, civilian servers or floating through echelon filters. Wow. I'm gonna pick professional, hopefully she likes that. Suave response is better. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. But I think I'm gonna go professional. I do need some handlers to uh, give me some perks, so... I think professional is the right way to go about this. We'll, we'll mess with this, I'm sure, in the future. I, I will, don't worry. It's me. Uh, Alright, send. Uh, yes, professional. No, she did like that. Okay, well there you go. Uh, okay, this fella. Don't like how he calls me Mikey. Uh, okay. Some things you need to know. This mission comes thanks to a local contact of mine. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. He's a double agent. Sam Fisher. Oh, some mud. Okay, I've studied up on the basics. It was built uh, into a sandstone cliff side in 1960 when Gamal uh, Ab Abdel Nasser, second uh, president of Egypt, was trying to start an anti-Saudi uprising in Yemen. Okay. That's right. I'm a history buff. No one asked you, dude. Uh, anyway, it's nestled in the ridge in such a way that it's hard for centuries uh, in the base to get a clear view of the terrain. Right. Okay. Local weather pattern suggests a sandstorm will hit soon. It is about uh, as likely as sun in Los Angeles or rain in London. We're going to take time. We're going to time your mission with a sandstorm. Well, that makes sense to me. I would do that too. All we're missing now is my eye draw telling me a uh, sandstorm approaching. I think we're kind of missing that. Uh, okay. I'll be your handler for the mission, but not your nanny. 
And now I tackle this mission with uh, stealth and a uh, buttload of, uh, of explosives when that fails. Okay. I don't care how you get things done, I just care that you get things done. I'll make sure all my friendly contacts are off-site, but don't worry about killing friendlies. Wow. Apart from that, uh, well, it should be a simple in-and-out mission. Just follow my lead and we'll kick ass. Take names, save the world, and be home... Uh, <laughs> okay, done with you. Need supplies, uh, okay. Visit the clearing- okay, I gotta go visit the clearing house. Let's do that. Okay. So we have a little bit of money. Oh, lots of options. Balance pistol clip. Recoil one. Sandstorm, do do do. Yeah. Do 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 do. Uh, basic pistol sight, accuracy one. That feels like a good purchase. I feel like the the clip and oh lighter lighter pistol barrel? Damage and stability, that feels pretty good to me too. Pistol ammo, steel core, tranquilizer rounds. I'm gonna buy a bunch of those. Okay, is that all that's in there? Tranquilizer rounds. Uh, I'll buy a couple lethal ones just in case. So, increased damage and armor penetration. Okay. Tentative damage over time. Poor against armored targets. Okay. So, I'm going to buy the pistol sight, the pistol barrel, and the... Okay. And vented pistol action. What does this do? Reduces damage. I see. Okay. Didn't really look through any of these guns, did we? I mean, they're pretty, they're pretty pricey, so an accuracy is not great. Okay. <laughs> Darude, rude, yeah. Yeah, form on the YouTube side singing Sandstorm at the moment. Uh, yeah, I don't really care too much about SMGs or shotguns. Yeah, maybe, maybe down the line, a rifle. Okay. Now the question is, do I have enough money to buy... What I want. Digital camouflage? Guessing these are mods. Okay, sound dampening. Uh, yeah, it doesn't seem like a lot of these really work towards sound dampening, do they? I like the idea of digital camouflage, though. Like Octo Camo, right? Can't really buy it yet, but... Yeah. Printed circuitry. Right, side bonus to lockpicking, electronics, and hacking. Not a bad idea. Not a bad idea. It's a short time delay before being spotted by cameras. Uh, mm. Let, let's face it. This is going to happen. <laughs> this is definitely going to happen. Uh, oh, I could probably buy a couple more of these. That's a good idea. By five. Uh, explosive, incendiary, EMP charge, temporarily disabled devices, sound generator, flashbang, remote mine, shock trap, incendiary bomb. Jesus. I just throw the briefcase full of supplies at him. Just throw the upgrade kit. You know, I do like this menu. I actually do like the presentation of this menu. I feel like a lot of games don't really do these kind of menus anymore, right? With a lot of gradients and... You know what I mean? A lot of games these days are very, like, flat, basic color. Like... Uh, like, uh... I mean, it's an aesthetic choice, but I keep thinking of, like, Hitman, you know? The newer Hitman games. Thanks for the tip! Oh! Dun 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 boom. <laughs> <laughs> wow, really shortened that, didn't it? Plus, you thank you very much for your five dollar super chat. That's really kind of you. Thank you. I'm glad you're all having fun singing Sandstorm. I wonder if we will get to see that mission, uh, or if that is the next thing we're doing. Thank you very much. Okay, uh, I'm gonna buy some of these. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, dossiers. These are Intel files. Okay. Bonus objective for arms dealer mission, uh, an anonymous black market source is offering intel on uh, Nasri's weapon shipments. Uh, reduction in enemy strength on the arms dealer mission. Okay. 
We'll run a sortie not far from Nazri's location and draw out any... Uh, oh, okay. That's interesting. You can feel the beat. <laughs> Do -do -do -do. Okay, intercept uh, Nazri, the arms dealer. Okay. Mission map for the arms dealer mission. That's... Okay, that, that feels like a must. Additional supplies to investigate weapons stockpile mission area. With a few dollars to grease the wheels, you can have al Samad's weapon supplier shuttle in more weaponry at bargain rates. Oh, uh, the war economy is real, ladies and gentlemen. The war economy is absolutely real. Uh, which you can then swipe during your mission. Okay. Let's go Jinzan weapon stockpile. So I kind of feel it, this is the priority if you're going to do anything in this menu. Getting these intel files is probably more priority of spendage. Uh, okay. Cool. Reduction in enemy strength on the investigation weapon stockpile mission. Right, so these are just like things to affect missions. Dossier information on Al-Samad. Purchasing this intel will expand your dossier on the Al-Samad terrorist organization. I like the idea of that. Let's bug the airfield. Uh... Let's buy this one, this one, this one, this one, and I got, I think I'll leave that for now. Can't get everything, which is a shame, but, but still. So I can archive all these? Okay, cool. Full on email system, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. Pretty cool, right? Pretty cool. Get a save in there. Alright, let's check out our loadout. I think we've got to go to the TV afterwards. Okay, so no armor mods, right? I didn't buy any of those. But we did get... A couple things. Yeah, recoil goes up by one. That might not be great. Didn't I buy a underbarrel thing? Or was that for a different gun? Oh, it might have been for a different gun. I just didn't notice it. Oh, well, that's going to happen. Um, I think that's everything. Yeah. Oh, two lots of EMP charges. <laughs> okay. Oh, actually, does that only carry... I'm just looking at the med kits. Does that only carry... Does that carry more? I see myself getting hurt a lot. Okay. Now, where's like... Here we go. Okay, this is what I was looking for. So... I was going to say, we got a bunch of stuff, right? The mission's available. Okay. Alright, we'll look into that in a second. Uh, Alpha Protocol, Dossier. Got 66% on that Dossier with those extra stuff we bought, which is cool. Which only well trained. Okay. Lots of reading, crew. Lots of reading. I bet it was found in 1907. Dossier, yeah. 48. Forty-five. Oh, yeah, it tells you their dossier completion up there to learn everything about them. Very much by the book. Fifty percent on the on the terrorist fella. Wanted by Interpol, intelligence agencies, and is widely known as the voice of Al Samad. Responsible for several anti-American broadcasts over the past several years. No worries, Blisky. Take the dog out for a walk. Looks like Doggy might need it. Uh, his superiors it did a little to advance his career, and that's okay. Like a hair. Twenty-seven. She's young. What's she doing in this line of work? Okay. 
Now that's a that's a uh, a grizzled soldier of I ever saw one at thirty at thirty three. This is a thirty three year old old man. <laughs> oh man. Uh, I feel like there was a lot of games, especially like I think Final Fantasy VII, right? Where I look at like uh, Sid Highwind. He's meant to be like thirty two, but he looks like he's nearly fifty. You know, <laughs> he's been through the ringer, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Alright, so there's a lot of useful information there, which is cool. My service record. Ah, I see, okay. It's just all my, uh... stiff. Right, this is just going through inventory again. Okay. Hey, welcome back, Fawn. Alright, let's talk to the TV. In Washington today, Senator Patrick Darcy unveiled new legislation aimed at cleaning up the federal government by greatly restricting lobbyists' access to legislators. The bill, called the People Over Rich Corporations Act, or PORC Act, would prohibit lobbyists from contributing to election campaigns and require anyone affiliated with a corporation to stay 500 feet or more away from any member of the legislative branch. Opponents of the bill have labeled it a draconian offense against free speech and so laughably unenforceable as to render it a farce. Right. Senator Darcy had no comment for INN News. Should American businesses be compensated if conflict arises in Asia? Legislation being discussed on Capitol Hill would assist with relocation costs for operations based in countries considered hostile to the United States. Detractors in both parties have attacked the bill as a massive bailout for companies that have outsourced American jobs. China and India are the largest destinations for offshore operations, with everything from manufacturing to software development being produced. I think the subtitles are going a bit too fast. Tensions continue. Alright. I think that was everything. Uh, okay, I think we're- I think we're good to go, crew. I think we're ready to try out another mission. Exit safe house. Alright, so, uh, what do we do here? Bug the airfield, investigate the, uh, stockpile of weapons, intercept Nazri the arms dealer. Okay. <sighs> what do we think, chat? What mission should we do? What mission should we do? I think it's the arms dealer one, or maybe the weapons stockpile. Bugging the airfield isn't a bad idea either, but... I mean, we can go either way with this. Do you get skull for too, too many emotes in chat? Yes, I came back and I'm like, what it happened? What happened? You think weapons stockpile, Shikido? Yeah? It's a, it's a good middle ground. The arms dealer? Okay, we're getting a few, uh... Few, uh, yeah, few suggestions here. Hmm. Yeah, I'm between these two as well. I, I'm not sure. Because I don't remember in this game is, if we pick a mission, can we go do the rest? Flip a coin? I don't have a coin. <laughs> what do I have on me? Hang on. What do I have on me? Is there anything on my app? Uh, uh, is, let's see. Anything on, on the app store here? On my app store? Check my phone. Roll a d20. Oh, do I have one of those nearby? Damn it, I don't. I don't have anything. My desk is too clean. Uh, can we flip the remote? Can we flip? I'll flip the remote. Let's do that. All right. All right. Uh, remote. Okay. Okay. So the button side, we do uh, weapon stockpile. Arms dealer is the flat side. Um, I will be honest with this. Don't worry. <laughs> Buttons, weapon side. Yeah. All right. Here we go. All right. Ready? Flipping the remote. Here we go. Here we go. Let's see if we can get some good audio for this. Ready? All right. We're doing weapon stockpile. <laughs> <laughs> it's the most ridiculous. <laughs> Love it. Love it. Yeah. Google coin flip. Yeah, I could do that. I just don't want to tab out of the game. I could have done that. Oh, I could have done that on my phone. I'm a fool. We, I forget. We have technology. Uh, oh, that was great audio. Oh, good. Good. I'm sure that sounded great. New soundbite for Twitch. <laughs> flip the remote. Remote works. Yeah. <laughs> 100%. All right. Stockpile. Um, all right, here we go. So investigate the Jinzan weapon stockpile. Search for any trace of the stolen Halbeck missiles. Okay. All right, so he's our handler on this one. I wish he wasn't, but okay. Uh, we get a perk from him, though. Tech savvy with gadgets being 10%. Okay. Uh, I might actually have a look at just what the other ones sort of look like, too. All right, so he's a handler for that one. Cooldown bonus on all abilities. And this one... Constant encouragement, endurance 10. Okay. Well, we did say weapon stockpile, so we're going to do that one. 
Uh, intel acquired for this mission. One additional intel uh, available in the store. I don't think we had any more money, though. Oh, we had a little bit of money. I think we'll, we'll buy it anyway. Oh, no, we've got two. Oh, God. Cool. Uh, let's see. Bonus objective added to invest, uh, investigate weapon stockpile mission. Darcy's contact in the area. Ah, oh, I remember this. Yeah, yeah, Okay. Additional supplies added to the... Uh, okay. I'm doing this one. I'm doing that one. Uh, yeah. All right. Start mission. What's up, Mikey? Problems already? Just checking in. Had some questions about the mission and Alpha Protocol. And you called me instead of Westridge? Lucky me. Been with Alpha Protocol long? Longer than you. So yeah, long enough. I wasn't looking. <laughs> I didn't see what the options were. I was curious how you managed to get this mission instead of me. But if you don't want to tell me, that's fine too. Suave. I don't remember asking for it so much as it being dumped in my lap. So there wasn't even a discussion? I heard there was a chance I could have gone. Never came up in conversation. Huh. All right. I thought you might have convinced Westridge not to send me. Guess I was wrong. Sounds like you're going to be my handler when I infiltrate the Asamad camp. Yeah, I got stuck handholding you. Hope that's not a problem. Be casual. Nothing's wrong. Just making sure we're good. Look, orientation's one thing. Wow, I actually like that. Another. People think I have an attitude, but it doesn't keep me from doing my job. I admit, I'd rather be on the mission. But you're the one Westridge picked, so let's get well, this Well, detention back. camp's the only option. The Asamad detention camp, where they got the weapon stockpiles. Anything you can tell me? Getting satellite imagery of the area has been hard. My contacts haven't turned up much. What's the problem with the imagery? Camp's remote and dug into the side of a canyon. Beautiful view, but lousy for spying from above. Any other intel you can give me? I'm still checking leads, but not much right now. The airliner going down has really scared my contacts. Been a bitch getting in touch with them. But as for getting into the detention center, the thing about the camp is weather. Sandstorms are hitting the area pretty hard. Which is to your advantage. How? It cuts down visibility for you and them. You need to sneak in before they know you're there. So just wait for the storm to kick up, then take them out. All right. Good to know. Oh, one other thing. They've dug in deep, with a maze of tunnels beneath the camp. If they've got any weapons down there, it's going to be a pain getting to them. Mm. So what do you recommend? They probably have as much trouble finding their way around as you do. So follow power lines or work lights when you can. Might guide you to where they've got their stockpiles. Got it. They use those same routes. Wait, did you just insult me? It'd be too hard to pick them off either. I'll upload what maps I have to your PDA. They probably keep the weapons in the bottom of the base. I regret doing this mission. Uh, well, explode. <laughs> That's all I need. See you in the field, Darcy. All right, here we go. First official mission. See the weapon stockpile. Let's blame the remote. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Should have flipped himself. <laughs> Insert Fred Durst and roll an emote from Twitch. You there? Yeah. Sit rep. No radio chatter, no alarms. Looks like you did a good job of getting in under their radar. Wish our choppers could. Would have saved us a lot of trouble. Oh, okay. Bad intel. No, sandstorms. They fuck with the satellite imagery. But they're great for someone moving in on foot. Let you get in for the kill before the bad guys know you're there. So wait for a storm, use it as cover. That's the idea. Also, oh, it well, dies down. Nice. Oh, I see. Okay. I see it. Okay. That's why they sent you instead we gotta wait till it kicks up. Cool. Up here. All right, we're in mission. Duffel bag. I got money. Very cool. I was gonna say, can I slide down a wooden ladder? Okay. Alright, cool stuff. Thank you for sitting through all the internet, Intel stuff, guys. It's, uh, this is definitely that kind of game where you got to take in the information and remember as much as you can when you go into missions. Um, but at the same time, you can just, just wing it, I suppose. And I'll, I'll do a little from column A, a little from column B. Alright. <laughs> the dice emote Texan. Love it. Oh, don't worry, Chiquita's got uh, YouTube covered with the, uh, the Fred Durston Roland emote. Don't you worry about that. Can I not move up and down? Yeah, I swear I can. Huh? Yeah, yeah, okay. Okay. Alright, so Sandstorm's kicking up. Okay. Now, question is, can I... Save? Okay, I can. Good. 
Alright, I see a couple folks. Uh oh. So that reminds me. Tranquilizer rounds. Good stuff, good stuff. Okay. Sneaky. Silent. Sandstorm approaching. <laughs> yeah, I do not have a ton of trank rounds, so definitely gonna have to use them sparingly. Surprisingly feels very good to play. Um, for a 14-year-old game, controls feel pretty good. I don't know if uh, that's part of the modding I've done or anything, because the modding really helps like, with the reticule and uh, I think some of the sound dampening and stealth bits, but uh, it's very light. Very lightly modded. Didn't want anything to like, completely change the gameplay. I want to still get enough of the original feel in it, you know. Bugs and all. Okay, so we do have a couple of skills. I'd be curious to try that out. And this one was the shadow renders you invisible for a brief time. As long as no, okay, yeah, that one would be would be good. Okay, so we just we just go invisible basically. Now, I'm not 100% sure, but I wonder if the intel files let us know where the guards were. I think they did, right? Snake eyes. Okay, I'm hoping that wasn't a kill. <laughs> I hope I'm pressing the right button. I'm not reading it. I think it's the B button. So, right, this is our trial mission, right? This is our trial mission. At the camp. They're dug in pretty deep. Any side of the radio tower? Yeah, it's across the canyon from me. A lot of open ground in between. Try not to get spotted. If you get trapped in there... I know. Interesting. Yeah, I see two guys over there. Very, uh... Very... I guess what, split a cell? You'd say? Seeing influences all over the place. Can't stop seeing Mass Effect either. <laughs> okay. Alright. Something over here. It's a ladder, okay. Cool. So there is a guy above. Oh, hi. I like your headband. <laughs> what? <laughs> I think that was a bug. Yeah, the, uh, the tweening between animations is, uh, doesn't exist. Okay, so where is this guy? He's coming back. Okay. Let's see if he starts walking away.
Nice. Uh, what do we got here? Luck box. Oh, we got some money. Nice. Thousand bucks. Who just leaves a thousand dollars lying around? Uh, so two guys still over there are an issue. Don't know whether to take that guy down below. I suppose if if they're not directly in my line of sight and they're not, you know, if they're not in my path, I suppose I don't really need to worry that much. I think I just worry if I get alerts. So I've got to get up there. Okay. Wait, what? <laughs> What a jolly little walk the guy had, yeah. It's almost as funny as my crouch walking. So, maybe up here? I don't know how their vision is. Give it a try. <laughs> Did anybody find my thousand dollars? Yeah. Well, someone left 1,500 here. Oh, God, no. God, no. Get off the turret, please. No, get off the turret, for Christ's sake. Wait a minute. Whoa, what is that noise? What am I hearing? I guess I can leap over here, but where does that lead? Just down below? I'm guessing I gotta get over there. Is this the door? No. Okay. Uh. Oh, it's just the radar. Yeah, yeah. Let me see you twerk, twerk, twerk. <laughs> it does look like twerking, yeah. Okay. Oh no, 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 no. It's just me as I feel like we're looking for liquid in the Middle East. <laughs> in this war, neither side is my enemy. We're just going to be patient. Uh, maybe just in case. Oh, okay. It doesn't last very long. Got it. Jeez. <laughs> liquid. Not a lot of liquid in the desert. Makes sense it would be hard to find. I like that. Damn. Well, I think the noise dampening is working. Cool. You drop anything? No. Still one guy. I might just take him out for good measure. Uh, one sec. Ah, damn it. Hang on. I can't believe this is how I have to tab out. <laughs> Watch this. I have to go with this, which makes it wonky. Now I can do this. I need to go do something on the Twitch side because 
Uh, you can't see it, chat, so don't worry, but my god. My god, Twitch bots are, are so annoying. All right. There we go. The last paid guard only had a hundred bucks on him. Yeah, that was his lunch money. Twitch being naughty. Yeah, it's just, just bots being bots, really. Okay, good stuff. Now, how do we get up where we need to go? I need to get up there, right? Ladder, okay. You are behaving. You're being good, Chiquito. Don't worry. You're being good. No, I've, uh, I've put in place the whole, you know, the cheap viewers thing and the best viewers at... I've, I've put them in as blocked words on the stream. Or blocked sentences. And uh, they come up as... Yeah, just like, block comments. Do you want to allow this through, basically? And uh, I just say, no, you're, you're a band. Now look for the generator. Should be in a building nearby. A guy in here. Is this game as good as I remember? Uh, that's still up for debate. It's uh, it's pretty fun. I'll give it that. We're still in the first mission, so a little too early to say, but... Uh, but for those that have played this, is this as good as you remember? That's a good question for the chat. Where's my eye droid? Can I scan that? <laughs> Sable generator. Generator's cut. Signal the choppers now. Can you get to their main computer beneath the camp? I think a way just opened up. All right. Is there a way down from here? Ooh, a zipline. How many other people we got? Okay. I have an idea. Okay, bad idea. Bad idea? Oh, wait, stomp, 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 stomp. Eww. Ooh. Okay. Oh, you put them in the other day and you still got a bot? Yeah, that's just... They're rampant. Snake, use your eye to scan the map. Yeah. All right, all right. Progress, progress. Hearing a lot of machinery. I'm in. Good. Now get to the servers and upload that data. You weren't kidding about the tunnels in this place. Got themselves a hell of a maze down here. Servers need power. Find power lines or work lights, then follow them to the source. They need to find their way around as much as you do. Got it. Oh. Cool. I get you. I get you. I mean, what? This game came out two years after MGS4, right? Feeling a lot of uh, MGS4 vibes here. Oh, locked door. Sable using EMP. Hmm. Okay. Wanna get in that room. <laughs> Okay, get out of it. Okay, I just use the AMP. Okay. Uh, okay. 
What do we got? Some secrets? Okay. Ooh, cool. What's this? Oh, he's noticing. He's noticed the dude. doing? No? Nothing? Unless he's like hearing me bang into stuff. Good timing. 2k in there. Getting high aid guards now. The underground guards uh, earn the most money, you see. They, they definitely do. Can we get some night flight in the chat? Can we not? <laughs> I don't want to hear that song. For quite some time. No, thank you. Continued hearing that song. Oh, there's a door over there. Continued hearing that song over and over. <laughs> Oh my god, that that day. The living infamy in my brain. But the question I have is, did you not have fun? Because I certainly had fun. Hey, another 2k. So healing. Don't think we need that right now. Definitely want to get more health. That's definitely going to be, a, I think, a next upgrade. All right, before we go down there, I think we're going to check this way. I know it's the right way to go, but I'm just wondering if there's anything else over here. Maybe not. Maybe it's just another path around. Okay, it was. No worries. That's not the, not the correct path. I've got to go this way. You love a door phasing through the wall there? Oh yeah, no, this this game has a ton of technical things like that. So uh, I, I think this game got something like was it like three and fours out of ten back in the day. Everyone was very harsh with this game. Unfairly so? I, I don't know. Oh, 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 okay. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Quickly, 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 quickly. Did the guy see? Oh. Shenanigan averted. You had lots of fun during crowd control? Nice. Gandabashi, thank you very much for my happy affiliate anniversary. I appreciate that. Thank you. Did the bot just flag it? No, I don't think so. It didn't know if it, I don't think it was just bad, it got middling reviews. Yeah, I, I remember people saying it's not great, but it's not good at the same time. But I remember just, especially a lot of people, I think in my crowd, who love the stealth games, they were kind of like, oh, dude, this game's ass. Like, don't play it. Like, just don't play it. And uh, when I did play it, I remember enjoying what I did play. Uh, but I think I did get to a point where I was like, like oh, I'm, I'm kind of screwed or something. Storage. There's 
No, but I will say, control-wise, it, it feels pretty good, you know? Just, I don't think that's one thing the game failed at, you know? Although I don't think this game really failed anyway. Uh, oh, bypass key code, okay. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Nice. Good job. No sign of the missiles, though. Looks like this place has been cleaned out. Damn. Guess that would have been too much to hope for. All right. Get to the computer if you can. On it. Ooh. I got free stuff. I got money. Man. The hacking stuff looks annoying. The only annoying ones, I'd say, is probably the lockpick, because it's super sensitive. And, um... And that, and that two, you know, the two code one you gotta do with the analog sticks. The, uh... The one we had to do for, for this door was, uh... That one's not too bad, I don't mind that. You're simply just finding the... You know, the source. Uh, okay. Let's give this a try. Damn it. <laughs> Don't even breathe. Oh, damn it. Okay. <laughs> yep. Just just let me through. <laughs> those EMP grenades are gonna be very handy. I'm gonna buy more of those. I think I might be out though. The only thing is the only review that got bombed on this game was IGN at a 6.5. I mean, that's IGN. Sadly, uh, I do not rate IGN very highly for reviews. In all fairness, I don't really read a lot of reviews when it comes to games I want to play anyway. That's a dude. Um, I tend not to. If it's a game I'm on the fence about, sure, I'll look, but... Uh, generally with IGN's reviews, I, I tend to go, uh, what's wrong with it and why they're going to take off like seven points for it. Which will be something very specific for that particular journalist, you know. That's, it, it always is. But anyway. Not that way. But how long does he sit there for? Yeah, yeah, locks can change, yeah. You go back in and the lock's completely different. That is a bit annoying. The... I mean, for, for something like a randomizer, if there was a randomizer mod for this, that would be cool, but... Uh... Yeah, I don't know. I think the locks should have been predetermined. Okay, he's not... He's just not moving. He just ain't moving. Did see another door. It's another hackable. Nope, okay. How do I go about this? No, I'm sorry, still getting used to the buttons. Sound generator. 
Jeez, he went running. That is not what I was expecting. I was expecting to throw something that makes a noise. <laughs> oh dear. The mother of all randoms or the random lockpick? And potentially. Actually, I don't know if there's like any any randomizer stuff with this with this game. I wonder if there is. Because when I was checking uh, the mod list, incendiary bombs, nice. Uh, when I was checking the mod list, there was only things like uh, like overhaul mods and you know things to completely change up the experience. So. You're basically in god mode when you play this game, because you get pretty difficult. Case in point, uh, did I see that right? Okay. Oh, no, it moved. Okay. Let's try again. Um. I think I see it over here. Uploading the information now. Okay, let me throw it, please. A lot of data here, and this system looks pretty state of the art. Receiving. You weren't kidding. Watch your back. They probably got guards on the way. These specs look like Halbeck targeting Jesus. data okay. tied into the radio tower. All right, get topside if you can. We'll have sound generators. You can use the help. Looks like we got company. A lot of it. So I'm pinned down. I got a Black Hawk on the way. Meet up with us topside. Oh, they're back to... Okay, they're back to... Their regular positions. Okay. That guy watching that one? Okay, he is. Hmm. How we go about this? Very intense checking the corner next door, yeah. Okay, so they're just blocking all the doorways. <laughs> How do I go about this? I, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, okay, okay. Oh no. Am I in trouble? Oh god. Hey, alright. Alright. Cones lifted. Level three. Found some stuff. Cool. Could have been worse. Could have been worse. Okay. Jesus. Alright. Where do we go now? Well, this was locked before, right? So I'm guessing this way. Cool. Checkpoint reached. Okay. Oh, okay. Mike, having a little trouble here. Their radio tower is down, but we're getting more resistance than expected. Can you secure the landing zone? Not a problem. Okay. Salt rifle ammo. Whoa, okay. Got the perk bloodshed.
Who's left? Who else is shooting rockets? Oh, okay. Line up, line up, line up, please. Thank you. Hi, buddy. Uh oh, uh oh. Come here. Goodbye. Whoa, okay. Alright, well, he's landed, but. Okay, so I can't use that. Oh, this actually might be a good time to try out the. Okay. Oh, that was cool. <laughs> nice. Actually, maybe go back to this. All right, so where's my way out? Your accuracy is atrocious, dude. We trained you. I took out two guys at once, it was cool. Good job, Mike. Not bad for the new guy. All the missions go as smoothly as this. You're alive, aren't you? All right, cool. Very nice. Uh, let's see, bonus objectives. Discover detention records in the camp. Bonus objective. That was a pretty good first mission. I was pretty happy with that one. Now, question is, well, any orphans? No, no orphans were created. <laughs> That's important. I think we definitely uh, missed up, or messed up the, uh, the stealth part, but... Uh, Ah, well, I think we did pretty good, all, all things considered.